everyone, so this is going to be a review video of the new Sugar Pill brushes. Um, I believe that there's just the four right now, though I could be wrong, so um, you'll have to check the link that I put down below. Um, but yeah, these I didn't even know about until they turned up on my doorstep, so I'm going to go ahead and review all four and uh, tell you what I think about them. I've been for a little while now, so I've got to try them out. Um, so first things first is the packaging. Um, they come in this really cute pink color, and it has the Sugar Pill emblem, and then the brush tips are pink, and then it says on the base of the brush like what the use is, so that's kind of handy for someone who's just starting out in makeup. So this one here that I'm going to review first is called the Large Eyeshadow Brush, and now it is exactly what it says. It is a very large eyeshadow brush. Um, for example, like it is the size of my lid. Um, I like to use this brush to put like one all over color, like generally a white or like a neutral base or something like that um, to go ahead um, and kind of like even out your eyelid. That's mostly what I use that for. Um, I think it's easier than using like a brush like this one is a what 239 for MAC so it's about half the size of that. Um, so you really cover a lot more space with this one. So all the brushes are synthetic and they're um, vegan and animal cruelty free, obviously. Um, and they feel like real brushes, which is really cool. Um, I really like them. I think they're great. I've cleaned them a couple times. They're really easy to clean and they don't stain, minus the lip brush, which is understandable. So um, yeah, that's that one. I happen to really like that brush, so I happen to use that one a lot. So then the next brush is the Tapered Blending Brush, and this is kind of your typical brush. It's meant to look, I'm sure, like, um, whatever this one is from MAC, I forget, but something like that. Um, now I find this one a little bit harder to use for me personally. I like stiffer um, blending brushes. This one is pretty, like, flowy and light. Um, however, if I want to do like a light eyeshadow blending job, that's what I use it for. Or if I went ahead and put in eyeshadow in a darker color and like packed it on and I want to blend it out, that's what I'll use this for. Um, again, it is fairly large, so it's perfect for like the crease area, that kind of thing, but um, not the best brush for detail work. So I like to use this to blend out that detail work. And then the third brush is the lip brush. Mine is stained because I've used it on some really dark colors. Um, this is just your standard lip brush. However, it is great. Use this in comparison to um, the OCC little mini ones. And I prefer this one over that. It has like a rounded edge. It's very stiff, which is what I'm looking for in a lip brush because it gets like perfect corners. And I like the round brushes because it curves your lip shape better than the square ones, I find. Um, so I really like this. I've been using this a ton. Again, it's a little bit hard to clean. You can see I've stained mine um, using like dark blackish purple lip color. So keep that in mind. It not, might not be perfect pink all the time, but um, if you wash it well, it should mostly come out. It's just I use like really dark staining lip colors, so um, that's why mine stained a little bit. So keep that in mind. But this is a fantastic lip brush. If you're looking for a new lip brush, I suggest this out of all of the four brushes, honestly. Um, this is probably my winner of, the all, of all four. And then the last brush in here is called the Precision Eyeliner Brush. And it's just itty bitty brush and it basically is to do eyeliner with. Now, I've used this with a lot of pigments. I use it with wet pigments, and it's perfect. Um, I like, I don't use gel. If you use gel, you probably would get a lot more use out of this. I personally don't like gel eyeliners. I like my liquid eyeliner. Um, so, but I have used this wet with like a gold eyeliner. Oh, it's awesome. So, I do like it, and it serves its purpose, so. Um, a good little brush. The four brushes, um, I would say, I believe they come as a pack and I think they come individually as well. Um, I would say if you're in the mood to like support Sugar Pill, which I love, I love the company, um, I would get all four because they're definitely fantastic. But I would say out of all of them, my one I prefer is the lip brush. That is phenomenal. Um, really, really good lip brush. It's the best one that I have. And I have MAC ones, Sigma ones, OCC. Um, so yeah, that's the one standout thing for me. Um, so yeah, all in all, I really like them. It's just I don't use, you know, some of them every day. Um, depends on what kind of eyeshadow look I do. Um, I use something like a uh, 239 from MAC 
on a daily basis. So these ones are more for like specific kind of things. Um, yeah, so that is, hopefully you guys enjoy it. If you have any questions, leave them down below and I'll try my best to answer them. Um, I'll put the link down below too to Sugar Pill website if you want to check them out. Um, again, these were sent to me, but I love Sugar Pill and so everything that they've put out so far I've been impressed by. So I figured I'd let you guys know my opinion on them. So I do hope you guys enjoy it and you guys are doing well. Um, and yeah, so until my next video, I will talk to all of you soon. Bye.